Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this step-by-step -step DIY video, I'm going to be showing you what every BMW F10 owner must do when they first buy their car. Let's go ahead and get this DIY started. All right, so um, go ahead and pull off this weather stripping. Set that aside. You got these small little clip ones. I'm gonna pull up on these and they'll pop right out. Set these aside. There's a few of them. And you got two down here. Then we got the T30s. Wiggle it out. Same thing. T30 underneath. So really the trick to get these, you know, kidney grills out is you, you can pull a little bit from the front, but you're also going to be going in the back of it just because of the clips. I don't want you to break anything, but it is nice to get it started as you see that I'm doing here. Um, there's clips all the way around, so this is where you have to kind of reach your hand in and, and push up while kind of pulling from the outside. You can easily remove these kidney grills with no skill whatsoever definitely changes the look of your BMW F10. And once you got it, you can feel it release. Ah, there we go. And the original one, so this is the one that the previous owner had. That one's out of there. Working on the other side. And then this side's out. Uh, so I'm just using just some bead maker here. Just, just take the light dirt off. Same thing with the other side. Go ahead and clean in the inside. Because you will be able to see in here. Now I'm gonna take it one step further. I'm gonna do some black on black uh, shine here. Loads of plastic. This black on black does a really good job. It doesn't get really oily or anything. It'll dry just like that. Really shiny. Over here, that's the difference. And make sure to get it all. It'll be a little heavy. Just take a microfiber, wipe down any excess off. The other side. Now you don't have to do this. It's just, you're in here, might as well do it. Now that everything is cleaned, take your M performance. And the good thing about a BMW part, they fit in 
perfect. You never have fitment issues since it's BMW made. Definitely going a lot faster. Same thing for this sign. Start snapping them in. Make sure it fits in all the way around. As simple as that. It looks so much better than what the previous owner had. So let's go ahead and put the bolts back in and then we'll take one last peek of it actually outside of the garage. Take all of your T30s. Don't forget this one down under here, the first part of the bumper. Don't forget this one back here. Go ahead and take your little pins here. It's gonna go back down on all these spots. Gonna take your weather strip that covers now i did see that it's a little dirty here so i'm just gonna go ahead and clean that out just so that's all clean and your weather strip just goes on just like this There you have it. Hey guys, well that does it for today. This is a must do modification for every F10 BMW owner out there. Changing the kidney grills really adds the look to your BMW, but going the BMW performance route you get a much better quality product, of course, versus any kind of knockoff brands that you have out there. You know, the fitment is spot on. You cannot get any better than what it is. And sourcing them through fcpeuro.com is the best of both worlds. You know, with their lifetime replacement guarantee on everything that they sell, all maintenance that I've done on my BMW 335i has been through FCP Euro. You know, with the, you know, better pricing, and get genuine BMW products or also OEM products that are out there. It's the best of both worlds for your BMW. So I'm gonna put all the links down in my description box below. You know, head over to FCP Euro. You can check out the M5 ones that I have, but of course, any other maintenance things that you guys need for your BMW, FCP Euro is definitely the spot. I also have all the other links uh, down in the description box below of everything that I used in this video. You know, guys, big thumbs up on the DIY. You know, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out the other BMW related DIY videos, informational videos that I have out there uh, for the M5 that I have here and also my BMW 335i that I have as well. Thanks, guys, and I hope you enjoy the week. Now, take care.